first, let's see how to create from scratch. We start from the upper assembly. And you see, you will see that this part, those two parts are missing. So we will create them from scratch. And we create them on, on the assembly. And we will use the, the uh, existing part to be sure to fit to the assembly. So first, we create a profile in this direction. We help ourselves with the existing part. And now we will create another profile in the other di direction at 90 degrees. So we, we can also use uh, some point of the assembly and give the dimensions that we need. Okay, this is now how to create the, the second assembly. You will see that if we, if we make a mistake, uh, for example, for the, for the height, this is not a problem, because we will use the trick of combining two extrusion. Then we will finish the first profile in adding a fillet. No, a chamfer. <laughs> I, <t> <laughs> I told you. <laughs> so now, two extrusions, and then we will combine those two extrusions, and we get the solid. But it's a solid, it's not sheet metal. Then we will, of course, uh, isolate this solid and cut in two, because the result must be two parts. So we will cut those, this solid in two parts, and then it's still solid, and we will shell, shell to get something with a constant thickness. And then we will apply our powerful sheet metal features. Then just in clicking, then we, we, we have all the, all the bands are created. Automatically, the junction are created, and we can switch a band to a junction to be accurate. Then we can add on the back four new flanges, five new, fl new flanges, <laughs> and you see that the meters are created automatically. It's magic. So, and of course, the part can be unfolded. You see, as it is fast. The, the, the second part, we will create two bands. We choose to create two bands. And then we will create automatically all the junction. And you see, it's very important, then we create junction not only on straight line, but on curves. And that's unique. And then we will create also, those three bands, three parts, uh, three flanges. OK, and it's finished. And this can be unfolded. Of course, the big band is recognized automatically as a lofted band, so made step-by-step -step bending. Of course, you can change if you want, but by default, it's like that. So now we will replace, in the assembly, we will replace uh, the, uh, the solid by the, the part. This assembly now is ready 
to be manufactured. So we will complete the, the second goal, produce the document and material for manufacturing. So we will launch the uh, uh, batch application that will examine all the parts, sort the part between sheet metal and non-sheet metal. The sheet metal parts are automatically unfolded. And the system automatically creates folders, different folders, and save the DXF, the result of the unfolding, on, in the appropriate folder, uh, so, sorted by, by sicknesses. So this, uh, the duration of this sequence is three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes for this assembly. You can imagine doing that manually. It's, it would be a, a nightmare. And most of the CAD system uh, uh, today, if they can unfold correctly, but uh, uh, do that m manually. So another thing uh, I have to insist is that we don't know. At the beginning, I didn't, I didn't say if the assembly is our assembly or an assembly coming from outside. For, for us, it's exactly the same. We can do that. This sequence, we can do that with our assembly. We can do that with a step file. That's, that's very important. We, 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 we don't import a step file just, for, just to see. Okay, we can uh, 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 rework and, and make this complex, uh, complex uh, batch uh, with DWG, Bricks CAD file, SOLIDWORKS file, step file, and so on. So we will wait for the, for the, uh, for the result. There, is a, there, there, there are a lot of parts. So you see that that's why it it's takes three, three minutes, three minutes and a half. It's time for pause. BricsCAD work for you. Okay, it's, ah, uh, no, <laughs> there's still some, and for, so, <laughs> no, I, I, will, I will show you this unfolding, it's, 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 uh, it's, it's, it's very, very beautiful. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> and, and you see your, our, our, two, our two parts? OK. Now, let's, let's see what we, what, what, what we get. We, we, we get a report with part, sheet metal parts, all the sheet metal parts are unfolded, and we get also so, some parts that we call poor sheet metal. Poor sheet metal means that can be sheet metal, but there is a problem. There, there are problem in, uh, 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 for the, to convert or to unfold. Uh, Ilya, can you can you show the, the, the unfolding of the cabin because it's it's quite, quite. so you see that we have. You, you, you see the kind of unfolding, complex unfolding that, 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 that we do. OK, come back to the, to the report. And then we, will, we have a problem with the part, the part which is a poor sheet metal. The, this, this is a good example. So we will open it and see what happened. But if, if we zoom, if we zoom on, the, on the corner, we see that it is not sheet metal. It is just a solid. Just a solid, just a shell. And we will use 
now our tools and we'll see that very quickly we will select all the vertical and, and tilted uh, lines and transform in junctions. Then you see that now we have junction and in just in clicking on bend and, and that's all, the bends will, will be created automatically. So the junction and the bends, it takes about two seconds, maybe. Maybe three. <laughs> so now we, we will use our smart split command because we cannot unfold if we don't make those splits. Unfortunately, we <laughs> have to do that eight times because they are eight corners. But this, this is quite quick. And the part, of course, will be unfoldable. This is important. So you see that this part is a part coming from uh, uh, on, we, we, we don't know. It can be a step. It can be. It can be a, a solid work. It can be anything. But in in three or four clicks, plus eight because of the eight corners, uh, we we create a, 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 a sheet metal part. Correct. And then we can unfold. 